What's up guys, we are back with another episode of Series 1 of XCOM. We are off to Leon, Mexico. Alright, so Leroy, you're out. Zhao, Whis, Ching, Sniper. It's not a terror mission, so it's okay. I don't... What's, what's, what's actually Patel's... Oh god, that aim is terrible. He was such a waste of meld. You look, you, you are out of here. You're gone. I'm sick of looking at you. <laughs> Alright, so he's done. Um, we're probably going to have to bring Leroy with us. Uh, because Thomas is injured for 11 days, Martinez is injured for 13, and one of our new rookies who's got an 80 is out for 8. So, what do we got? Heavy, 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 sniper, assault. Alright, it's, it's who we've got available. Uh, just going to put this guy into Carapace armor. Gonna give him a sicker looking uh, exalt. Is there any difference? Three to five. Three to five. Zero percent chance of critical. Zero percent chance of critical. Critical. If it does, goes. Yep. Exactly the same. Uh, exalt rocket versus our rocket. Base damage six. Base damage six. It looks sweeter. I'm just going on that. Um, he's got a very bad chance of hitting stuff, so I'm gonna give him a plus ten to hit. I'm going to change your loadout as well to that of Exalt, because it looks badass. Uh, okay, base. We're using Light Plasma Rifle because it gives plus 10 to aim, so she should hit pretty much every round. Loadout. Let's go for badass. Grenade, yeah. Um, I found I didn't use the grenades last time, but this is not an exalt mission where you can just shoot everybody dead, Dave, before they get a chance to do much of anything. And now sniper's back. Exalt sniper. And another five of the best, because I don't want her to go down. So, uh, Inez was in briefly as a sniper. She's out yet again. Um, and Zahar is back in. Sahara has got two better Strike aim one. than Inez, and we're just sort of seeing how they both level up. Uh, if one of them levels up better than the other one be in terms of in aim Mexico and their, their abilities, We've then we'll pick that one over the other, and we'll have to give uh, Inez meld, if that's the case. And then the other one will be relegated to operative. Alright, so we're looking for Meld. Meld is typically over here. And then the other one is typically somewhere along this vicinity or even up. Um, there tends to be a lot of aliens inside the warehouse and also along this car route. This car route is very dangerous, especially with the amount of heavies I have access to. Tend to be typically going in for the kill. Because uh, they're explosive, I can use it to my benefit. I probably shouldn't dash Roger it that far right. out on our own, but eyes on target. Yep. Shouldn't have done that. Weiss is my closest. Rockets. And this is why I like heavies. With all those cars. Boom, bitches. Boom. Oh, wait. Squad sight. I forgot about that. And because of that rocket freed up one sight, Zahara still missed. Oh, I needed that to hit. At least the car's on fire because it'll blow up the car. Put him well, there and hope that he gets a shot. Nope. Um, let's put him there and Heading hope up. he gets a shot. Nope. Let's put him there and hope that he gets a now shot. Yeah. One of them is shoot. No. Alright, so let's move him there for next turn. Him there Roger for next that. turn. And now that the cars have been exploded, 
Um, they should not present a problem to us in terms of exploding on our guys, position. which is the other reason why I like heavies in this level. Because you can just go, like I did, and explode most of the cars. Um, that exploding car, or that car on fire, oh man, um, should enable us to um, survive a bit and force him to move, which it has, because he doesn't want to be near that, because at the end of his turn, the car explodes. I'm going to try a tactic for dealing with Seekers that I'm going to employ here. I don't want See, I kind of want all three cars in, but I can't seem to get all three. So, let's do it like that and try and cover as much of that car as possible and open air in case we get lucky. Got one. See? Dead. So kill one of the little seeker bastards before they can even get anywhere close to your dude. So let's move Zahara close in because she needs to be protected by Overwatch. Um, move her there so that way she can protect others and be protected herself. Overwatch. Right, Overwatch. And move Mr. Weiss to there. So, ooh, he's protected by the Overwatch. Overwatch. Put him on Overwatch. And put the same on Overwatch as well. And wait for the Seeker to come to us. There we are. Don't know why he revealed himself there. But he's dead. Uh, we've got one floater still muddling around still a little standing. bit. So we're going to move away from him and towards the meld. Aye, aye, Commander. I'm just going to spend this turn setting my guys up. Uh, the mail counters are based on where they're located in the map and how many turns the game thinks it'll take you to get there. So the ones that are further away from you tend to be tend to have a bigger countdown, whereas the ones that are closer tend to have a short countdown, which is why, considering this is near the start of the level, um, I'm going for it early as possible. I put Zahara in a bad position there, that was stupid. Solid copy, Commander. And a move. Rick. Ten four. There. He's got a rocket and he's on a bad angle. Put her on watch, just in case. Ah, oh, I probably should have reloaded her gun. Oops. Alright. Let's have a look inside. Alright, so there it is on the other side of there. In bewegung. There we go, Leroy's got the movement to get there. So we'll put him there, and hopefully we won't spot him. Yeah. I'll put these guys on Overwatch. We'll leave them alone. I'm on the we'll move. go this way and look inside the other shop in a little Scanning. bit. Put Sahara Step here because that should give her the ability to snipe down the field and into both houses. Uh, both buildings, I should say. All right, Bricky, where are we going to put you? Oh, I'm going to put you there Already so that way there. you can't see through into the other building. Just because I don't want to bring any aliens into it. Yeah, it looks like they're inside I that building. We are alone out here. Of course we're not alone out here. And the other meld is inside that building too. So open the door. Put That's her there. What was that sound? I can't see anybody inside just yet. Let's put 
to him just do. there. So put him actually inside the room. Eight turns to get to that meld. I have right, so let's go through this at a reasonable pace. This guy's got my, all the speed, so we're going to use him to dash all the way up. Kick the door. In we go. Alright. Um, I want Zahara inside now. So she's going to come inside and sit there. Put Brick inside the there as well. And then they will serve as Overwatch for the next right. turn while Zhao yeah, and Zhang and Whis all move forward. They might actually be in the back alley, outside the building on the other side. Right, so let's move you to there. You want Overwatch? And yeah, I'm being pretty cautious, but. Alright, so where's the door? Oh, I haven't got many choices. We're gonna put her there. Let's do this. She w didn't have many choices in terms of options or where to go. Go put Running. him there. I'll Should move like the there. wind. So I'm not going to have many guys on Overwatch this turn, it's a lot of movement throughout the building and the, there's nobody in the building to uh, hinder my progress as well. There's that one floater out to my left outside, I haven't forgotten about him. I'm hoping you guys haven't as well, put her there. Double time. Uh, and hopefully we'll get to deal with that alien shortly. Yeah, they're definitely outside. Shh. I think I heard something. Oh, uh, no, yeah, not anymore. Now yeah, they're definitely inside. Alright, that's not too bad. Put a couple of bullets onto him early. Uh, that could have gone a bit better. They're going to get a secondary movement. And they're stop it there. The um, the where's my new guys? My you. You're new-ish. Uh, put a grenade there so it'll get you a kill. Where's another one of my new ones? Um, we snow. She hasn't got a nickname yet, so she's still relatively new. Get her a kill. Where's the guy who's got Leroy's got all my movement? Put him there on the actual meld. So I'm obviously trying to recover as much meld as possible now because. Um, out. I've made some really poor choices on who to give the meld to. I gave it to a lot of guys who I hoped would be good and turned okay, out big. that they were not as good as I originally thought and I need to make sure that I save my meld for the appropriate people from here I'm on in. Uh, so that would be soldiers who have 80s at rookie status or 75s or thereabouts with Zahara. Hopefully this is the last kill of the mission. Got him. Nope. Click that meld. I'm gonna put him in those doorways. So you do get a couple missions late in the game which give you a bunch of meld as well. Um, and I'm trying to steer clear of the mech warrior. Just because they tend to eat meld. And I will probably use one of my backup snipers in the Mech Warrior late game. I'll be watching. Just because they have the best aim, or they will have some ridiculous aim. And I would like them to be able to hit things when they shoot. And a sniper gives them a weapons platform that when they stay stationary, they get an additional plus 10 to aim. Alright, so they're outside. Oh, there they are. That, that was handy. Overwatch. Zang's got a shot on the one there. Doesn't get the hit. Zahara can deal with that guy. This time. 
They are attempting to flank. We'll go with the percentages. Bye nice. Bye. Hey, promotion. Nice. Fifty-five percent. Oh, he got the kill. I love those cutscene no kills. I have no ammo. I can't engage. Alright. Okay. So I'm gonna pop her there, which shouldn't trigger the Overwatch. I feel, Commander. And him there, which also won't trigger Overwatch, but we can put Overwatch on. Brick's no good, unless we put Roger him that. there. Because he can see through that door and out that window. Put him on Overwatch. And he can see out to the other and overwatch. We're gonna force that last photo to come to us. Here he comes. Leroy's got the... Oh damn! Didn't kill him. Hopefully he'll come in the door now and trigger another overwatch. Yes, Commander. I'm gonna send Brick out. He's got enough hit points. Oh no, he's fine. 100% chance to hit. Last kill, come on. Yeah. Killed 10 aliens, no operatives lost, both canisters recovered. By the books. Operation Banished Knight. Done. Dusted. Easy. Alright, so... When we get our next set of council money in, I'm thinking that we need to buy the tactical rigging. Ooh, well lots of promotions. The aliens don't oh wow, chance. as if her name wasn't long enough that you give her a nickname with two words in it. Double down Zhao. Being promoted to sergeant. Uh, suppression and close and personal. Close and personal's you know, reasonably okay for dealing with muttons um, and brutes and so forth. Uh, suppression's pretty good. I don't tend to use it. I'd much rather her shoot and hit than give them a negative 30. So I'm going to go close and personal just because of my personal playstyle. Robbo has been promoted to lieutenant. He already had his nickname. He's got lightning reflexes. I'm going to take that because that tends to go the way I play. He's been promoted to uh, captain. I'm going to use danger zone on him just because of the way I use him. I should probably be giving him... I'm going to give... I only really bring him along so he can deal extra bits of damage randomly, so we're going to go straight into Rocket. She's been given the title of Stalker. She's been given Covering Fire. Covering Fire and Low Profile. Low Profile is usually one of those ones you don't get a choice of, you get given it. She's up to an 88 name as well, from an 82, 83? So she's going to buy 5 or 6, which is on average to above average. No, sorry, average to below average. Uh, average for a sniper being 6 per level. So I'm gonna get covering fire so that way I can get her to overwatch on shots as well and possibly stop the shot coming through against us. 20 mild, not too much else. Panic in Mexico has decreased by 3. We will be wow! In touch has that also out. affected the rest of... no. Oh my! Argentina, Brazil, Egypt, France and Russia have popped up a little bit. We're not doing well. Can we launch satellites yet? No. When do they kick in? Five days. Alright. Uh, then we're going to cancel report in eight. Oh, we're stuffed, guys. We are so beyond wrecked. Right, so we're going to do panic in Germany, panic in Argentina. Scan for activity. Um, and this is literally just because of the way I did a lot of my building early on. I did not go for the appropriate um, sources. I'll just skip through that. Uh, it's pretty much just an interrogation. It's not really anything worth viewing. So we're going to scramble interceptors. This might help. Especially if we can shoot it down, because otherwise panic Bangs will increase out. in Africa, and we don't want that.
Come on, check it down, 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 check it down. Come on! Oh, 1.6 on the clock. Whew. So send the Sky Ranger out. We're going to give... Take you off that and give you Arc Thrower instead and give him the Meg Kit because he's got Field Medic. Um, clear. Oh, looks like I'm stuck bringing Oise along for the moment. Um, Alright, on we go. So this should help. Uh, shooting down UFOs and then assaulting the bases usually brings down the Africa for this panic one. level. And we need uh, to get so hopefully Egypt will drop its panic level a little it bit. Like and we don't have to put a satellite there. So this will be the last of the missions Central from this episode as well. So I'm going to try and make this quick. Copy, big sky. So let's move Strike her there. Because that triggers those guys, and there's also meld really close by that melds. Oh, I've only got four turns, that's not too bad. Just reminded you can't do is running down and close to person. Got, got one kill. Beach that should be off. range to kill the other one, but it is waste, so he hasn't got a good percentage. Hey! 51% rocks the day. Alright, so Brick can move forward and dash. Moving out. Because we've dealt with those two floaters. Um, I want to say there's going to be about... I am 10 out. aliens in this crash. That's around about average for this level of the game. Maybe 8. So we're going we're gonna to assume yeah, double figures. So we've got 2 down, 8 to go approximately. I'm just moving my sniper into whatever position I can goddamn get her. Still That'll have to do, I guess. She got put away at the back. I'm gonna have to move her up the listing because that affects where they get listed. Oh, and they hop off. Alright, Leroy, my uh, little sprinter. Pick up the meld and wait there. No? Alright, so that means that the alien craft is in that direction. There it is. Let's see it now. Um, I'm going to use her running gun now. Down. And try and put her out that doorway. Rolling out. Enemy spotted. One, two, three. Three more floaters. It's a total of five enemies now. The 86%. Oh, miss! Damn! Ah, oh, damn it! Ah, oh, come on! She should have squad side. On it. So I move brick up. And hopefully, I can deal with the issue of squad side by blowing up. No, can't. Can't quite get it. 63 and 63. Doesn't matter, just pick that one. And got him. That's not too bad. Nope, she still can't see. Weeks has no shot. Oh, that was a really bad shot, because it's left arm. Um, double down Zhao with no cover. This could be bad. So we'll see. Oh, she got the reaction shot. That's gonna miss. Yeah, called it. You can see it by the way she was sort of aiming it. They really need to fix that animation because her hand goes quickly while the bolt goes slow. I was lucky. I'm taking fire. So we killed one of those three. There's the other one. He's also going to shoot at her. That one hits though. Seven! she down? No, she's standing. Here comes another three. And they're all thin men, Which brings our total up to eight. Leroy misses. So, I'm effectively going to have to pull my advanced member who's... Oh man, they are just sitting darks. 
bring her back to there, there now. because it gives her some some relief from all the shooting. Are uh, you cover? Kill confirmed. Oh, come on, show's blocked. Come on, no, 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 no. no. I really want this to work, because that'd be three easy kills. Oh, sweet! And you got it promoted. Awesome. Zahara's got a shot, she gets the kill. So it was a group of two, a group of three, which makes five, a group of three, which makes eight, which means there's probably only the outsider left, and maybe a sectoidal two inside the UFO. Um, that's sort of how you gotta play the numbers in this game. Is they don't really place the aliens appropriately. So if you can get a little lucky like I just did, let's heal her next turn. Um, you can wipe most of them out and then go into the UFO knowing that you should only have a few to deal with. So let's do that heal first because he's got four heals. Easy now. Does he have deep pockets as well? Must. No, wait, let me go back to him. Yeah. Alright, so let's move her one move and then reload On her weapon way. because we're going to need her accuracy. Let's rock. And hopefully we can upgrade her shortly to a plasma rifle instead of a light plasma rifle. Just for... Oh, I see, no, I don't want to be too far ahead. So let's overwatch him. Leroy's got some good move, so we'll move him to there. Team. We'll go up the stairs and jump off the ledge. Yeah. Most direct route. Gotta love it. Uh, and Sahara, who I wouldn't I'm mind if she picked up Sprinter, just to keep her effectively where she is. Because if she does, I might as well pick her up like mimetic skin, so she can always be invisible unless shooting. We've also got Meld over there. So let's use Leroy as a scout now. Put him there. Alright, so there's two ways to go about this mission from here on in. It's either get that last kill or kills and collect the meld that way, or actually flank out and get the meld itself. I might try and do both, be a little greedy. Uh, or effectively just hedge my bets. I'm going to use Whis because Whis is a little bit more expendable than anybody else. And he's also got two rockets and a grenade, so he's got a lot of firepower for one individual. Zang! Oh, what the hell? I'm going to want her ready for the next mission. Because I think we've got an extraction coming up shortly, and she's very useful, so we'll heal her. It's not like the healing make kits are non-disposable. Yeah, just it. reinforce the fact that there's aliens. Cheers. Put her there Affirm because it. it'll give Moving her a out. decent squad site shot because she can see into the UFO and also on Weiss's position. We'll move her to here because move. it didn't trigger before. It shouldn't trigger now. And then we will move Weiss in first. There he is. There. Because if he gets it, oh, it's a single turn. Um, so next turn it'll run out. So where's Leroy? My Dasher. Je force. I probably should have gone into the center chamber. All right. Running. So I'm gonna dash my guys forward. I'm not gonna be able to get that meld. The melt's lost. I think I spent a little bit too much in terms of terms. Yes, sir. Uh, just healing and overwatching is probably where I lost access to that meld. So recovering 10 out of 20 meld is great. Uh, it's better than zero. Um, but look, you, you get what you're given. Moving we got 10, so position. I can't complain. Considering I haven't effectively been spending my meld. Uh, if you want to watch the effective spending of meld and a few other bits and pieces, you're going to have to watch my other video. Um, 
I've learnt a lot through playing this and also defeating this recently. Uh, I've got one of my other playthroughs which is not recorded, which has given me a lot more knowledge about this game, because previous that I hadn't completed the enemy within. Right, let's put him there and then take the shot with Leroy. I'm actually liking Leroy at the moment just because of Sprinter. It means I can get places. Yes, he hasn't got the greatest shot in the world, but occasionally does the job. So we just missed out on that last mount, which is unfortunate. Alright, so that's the end of this video. Uh, we'll level Leroy up. Who's still stuck at a 60, and this is one of the problems I have with the heavies. The aim progression is between 0 and 2, um, and literally, you can get a you can get a character like Leroy who just does not progress in aim at all, and you have to give him that scope just to make up for it. And you could be using that scope, as you can see, he's got Grenada now, and I'm going to have to use Grenada from now on, um, just because he's my huge damage output dude. Oh, cool. So we picked up some damage stuff which we can sell. So we'll do that. Um, cool. Let's sell down to one. Let's sell down to none. Sell both of them. Sell both of them. That's an extra 100 credits in our pocket. Oh, we can also sell some of those. Go down to three. Go down to three. Go down to three. Let's go down to 375. Let's go down to 250 there. Cool. And we'll hire some more dudes with that. Ah, uh, actually, no, we probably shouldn't. We probably should build some satellites. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Let's build two for the moment and let's build facilities. Build access, and then we'll build there, and then put another satellite there as well. All right, so that's enough for this episode. Um, you can sort of see where I'm going. Here's the upcoming events listing. Uh, so we've got interrogate sectoid if almost finished. We've got another satellite coming up in two days, followed by more uplink, uh, and we're ten days from having another three satellites, and twenty days from another two. Um, so, the cancer report will kick off in six days and that'll determine whether or not this is salvageable. Uh, we're going to really struggle not having all the council members, as you can see the situation room. Uh, it is poor. Right, let's just go into launch satellite so you can see it better. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six with max, one with one off, one and two at three. We're doing poorly, <laughs> to say the least. Alright, so... Uh, if you want a bit better gameplay on how to play this game a bit more efficient and all that, you'll need a, you'll, you should check out my other series, Series 2. Hit the subscribe button to stay up to date with all my videos. I post multiple a day uh, if I can. I've got like some 7 going up today, so that would be a good note. Well, the day though of this recording, but not the date of this being put up. Alright, so this is Matt from Armstrong Gaming. Uh, thank you, you for following and watching. Them bringing back alien body parts as souvenirs. It's a breach of protocol. <laughs> what? Central, you're crazy. Alright, so we'll see you next time, guys. Take care.